The Scranton Wilkes-Barre Rail Riders are right back in the thick of the International League East Division race, but a flurry of moves by the Yankees just before the trade deadline has significantly altered their roster, especially with regard to the starting rotation. Some familiar faces are missing at PNC Field this week as the Rail Riders return home. J.P. Sears and Ken Waldachuk were traded to Oakland for Frankie Montas, and Hayden Wesneski was traded to the Cubs for Scott Efros. Three Rail Riders starting pitchers gone, which means Doug Davis needs to make some adjustments. Obviously, it take, you, know, you take a big hit from a team standpoint when you lose three starting pitchers out of your lineup. Um, you know, but, you know, typically in the past, the Yankees, that's happened to the Yankees before, and, and I've been here where it's happened at this level, and, you know, just guys keep coming. In this case, some call-ups from AA, but there are still proven pitchers on the roster, which leaves Davis feeling optimistic about keeping things together. We also have a pretty good group of guys where you have the Clerk Schmitz, who have been fantastic at the major league level, and now he's here to get built up. You know, you plug him to a starting role. Uh, Ryan Weber, who's a veteran guy, who's been very, very uh, consistent. The Rail Riders have good reason to feel good. They went 18 and 6 in July, vaulting them right back into the division race, and the return of Oswaldo Cabrera to the lineup has been a big reason why. His OPS was over a thousand last month. The vibes changed in the clubhouse. So I don't know what happened inside there, but right now we are feeling so good. We are more together as a team. So I think that that's all the vibes. The vibes that we got right now is really good. As of Wednesday, the Rail Riders are just four games out of first place and now begins the home stretch. We've got two full months now to be able to just continue to play and see where we're at at the end of this. And we're going to play teams that are ahead of us, so we certainly have an opportunity to make up more ground.